what was it like for 16 people inside the basket of the doomed hot air balloon that crashed in Texas, killing all on board? <laughs> to find out, I took a flight in a similar craft operated by Magical Adventures Balloon Rides near San Diego. It's the first time for each of these passengers, but none were deterred from taking the ride by the disaster. But it's nice. I'll just hold on tight. Before we left, pilot Denny Barrett demonstrated the safety procedures that are routine on hot air balloon flights. Flying in this balloon, it feels like you don't have a care in the world, but before and during the flight, we were given extensive safety training. Denny has 19 years experience as a pilot and instructor. You put heat in. To go up, you pull on this rope here to go down. Stay out of power lines. It's as simple as that. The biggest danger to hot air balloons comes from overhead power lines. I know where the big power lines are, right along Rancho California Road. The hot air balloon, which crashed near Austin, Texas, hit power lines five stories tall. The crowded basket was incinerated. Why the balloon was flying so low is still a mystery. So what you have to do is you have to watch for the poles. If you see where the poles are, then you'll be able to identify where the power lines are. Keeping the basket level is also vitally important. This basket can hold 12 passengers. There are nine of us here, and you can see that we're separated by this barrier because we have to stay on this side to keep the basket level. Denny has this advice for anyone wanting to take a hot air balloon ride. Don't buy tickets from a discount organization. Make sure your operator is a member of the Balloon Federation of America. These poignant photos were taken by passengers inside the basket of the doomed balloon minutes before the crash in Texas. The 49-year-old pilot of the ill-fated balloon, Skip Nichols, had a record of four drunk driving offenses and had served two prison sentences. He was banned from driving, but incredibly was still able to keep his balloon pilot's license. The highlight of our balloon ride was this proposal by Jeff Bailey. I'm asking you now, will you marry me? <laughs> his girlfriend, Seneca, said yes. And there was a happy ending to the flight, a perfect safe landing. <laughs>